Okay, guys, Akumado Crypto here. Hi, hi. Guys, um, wait a sec. Uh, this is my Twitter. If you haven't followed me, please consider doing so. My Steam it. Yes, I'm trying to build this thing. My blog here with a lot of uh, content. Please give me some support there as well. Okay, um, before anything, I would like to talk a little bit about what is to be a trader. Okay, I would like to ask you a question. Yeah? What is to be a trader, guys? It's what do you think it's about? It's about being right all the time. Is that what you think it is? Because one problem that that I uh, that I see a lot about it uh, that uh, it's one thing that I that I heard a lot is that people says, okay, but you use Elliott waves, but you are not right all the time. Your calls sometimes you are wrong. Okay, most of the time I'm wrong. Let, let, let let's face it, and I know that, you know, and I know that I'm wrong. So why should I be a trader? Okay, let's think about it. Have you ever, have you ever read a behavior book, a behavior psychology book, or a behavior econo a book about behavior economy, such as those here? Have you ever read Fooled by Randomness? Have you ever read studies about trading? about uh, the Wall Street. So, trading is not about being right. Trading is about, is about being conservative and about managing your positions and about luck. Seriously, it's about luck. It's about a lot of the success can be attributed to luck. Okay, you see, but no. You can tell me, but no, but I know this guy on YouTube, he is always right. Hmm, seriously, let, let, let us wait 10 years. Okay, he's right, okay, let, let's face it, he's right. Let's wait for 10 years, okay? Uh, it's not me talking about this, it's, it's guys, like this guy here, like Dan Ariely, uh, like Daniel Kahneman, uh, we're talking about guys that have studied this. That we're talking about, and so many others. Okay, this is just one of the. I'm presenting. I'm presenting you guys. Um, I'm presenting as I am an academic. I'm presenting you guys things that tells us that uh, knowledge that is uh, important for us, and that is it's here to 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 to, to pave the way for us to make us better humans and better traders okay because if you are in this business of crypto or trading stocks whatever for one year you want to be rich in one year sorry you are you are bound to fail this is a statistics this is not likely to happen sorry Yo, oh, but I know one guy that he bought. You know one guy, and you are telling me that this is the the statistics that you are using. This is not. This is not how you are deluding yourself. Okay, you are kidding yourself, and this is not how we trade. We trade based on statistics. We trade based on assuming that we are wrong. Okay, I assume all the time that I'm wrong, all the time. And I, I want, I, on my Twitter account, I won't be bragging about my positions. Never. Never. I won't show you guys, oh, see, ha, 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 here's my position. I made like 10% this time and 11%. You know why I don't do that? Because this is most of the time lies. This is most of the time uh, a bad strategy for the long run. This is a bad strategy for the long run, guys. Bad, bad strategy. And I'm I'm not I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you why. If you wanna know, okay. If you wanna know the reason, you should read this book first, Fooled by Randomness. He presents the the arguments perfectly, and he presents two different guys, two two different uh, trade, two two different traders. One is a conservative, and the other is the this guy that I'm describing, 
the puffed uh, alpha of himself guy that makes a lot of money in one year. What do you think is going to happen, guy? What do you think have happened with those two guys, the conservative and the 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 run of the mill kind of uh, Wall Street market, Wall Street guy that use a beautiful suit and um, it's a, a, a the, the kind of alpha male guy that trades all the time and it's oh I never misses a trade. What do you think is what, 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 what do you think is the the outcome of those two traders? I encourage you guys to read the book if you want to know, but I'm gonna tell you guys. They don't last long. They don't last long. They, they are not here for the long. They, they are not here now. They don't last long because money, guys, markets, they are, they are uh, long linear. They are dynamic uh, systems. We, we don't control all the variables. Okay? They don't. Well, so when you say that you are right all the time and then you show that you are right all the time, you are telling the community here on Twitter, you're telling the community that you know. And I, I don't say that I know. I say that I might be right. I might be wrong. And I, I, I sorry, I am wrong. I assume that I'm wrong, but I might be right. And then I present you the, the technique that I use to support my view. If I'm right, okay, let's let's go to the next trade. Let's go to the next trade. We are. I am. I am. I am thinking about ten years from now. Oh, but ten years? No way. No. If you are so full of an anxiety, hmm, it's a bad sign. If you are trading for the next year only, hmm, seriously. Do you think that, that crypto is so fast that you can make a bank like next year? And then you're going to show me, hey, here it is, Akumaldo Crypto. I have this video. I made, a bank, I made a bank in two days. I made a bank in one week. So what do you have? I say, I, I have nothing. I'm not going to say, sorry, I know I don't have a, a, a bank. I, I can't make a bank in two days. It's not my style. Okay. But show me this same kind of uh, data in 10 years show me the same kind of statistics in 10 years my friend and then sh and then present me at the same time your uh your full body scan of your health how how well your health was along this whole period of 10 years are you really well are you really your your cholesterol your Cortisol levels are fine because this sounds to me a lot of stress. Hmm, what a, what kind of trade-off are you doing, huh? Sorry, guys, this is a kind of a <laughs> a warning, okay? Because I see a lot. Of <laughs> if you read my story here uh, on Steemit, you want, you are going to understand that this is not the beginning for me, okay? This I have been I have been on crypto for a long time for since 2012 this is not a lot of time and i've been training i have been training crypto for real like one year and i have been failing like terrible terribly and why because i am honest i'm telling you guys the truth okay i am i am a, a victim of the market as well i'm not gonna lie but I am learning and I am here for the 10 years ahead. I'm here to really understand the market, try to understand the market. And I'm going to, I'm never going to stop reading. I'm never going to stop learning. Okay. And, and okay, let's jump into Bitcoin now. What, what was, why did I need to explain myself? Just because I felt that it was in need of, uh, just to, to tell you guys my style, okay, to show you guys what is my style, what kind of trader I am. I am a trader that is a, like an academic. I am a trader that is a scientist. Okay, I'm never. I, I am always trying to to. I am trying. I'm, I'm trying always to falsify what I'm doing here. Okay, that's it. So. 
here we have our daily chart. This is the 200 DMA. And we have uh, retraced a bit. And as I, as I have said, this is the 200 DMA offering support. Okay, we touched it and we had a, a pullback. So I, we haven't finished it yet. We have like a spinning top now. Yeah, kind of a spinning top. Yes, it's a spinning top. We have this pullback here, and uh, it's 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 uh, it's within the it's within what it's within what we have planned, right? This is the weekly chart. We are above the this ABCDE, and we are again we are still sitting above the twenty one EMA. Okay. Uh, here we have this cross, but I have discussed the 21 EMA is if we keep going on this, we are going to cross the 100 EMA here. Another cross would be nice. Okay. Remember, if you are looking for a bullish market, we are looking for something like this. 21, 100, I'm sorry, 21, 55, 100, 200. Okay. We are looking for something like this. We're not we don't have something like this yet we have the opposite so we have room we have plenty of uh not plenty but one month at least of uh new highs we need new highs we need to we need this high here okay we need to challenge as i said yesterday yes this two that's this 10k we need to break it and we need to establish a new local high okay Let's see the one hour chart here. I, I'm going to present first my count. Okay, this is my count. Okay, the way I count it is the truncated fifth here, fourth, five, one, two, three, four, five, one. I'm sorry. One, two, three, four, five, one. Then the two here, we have this flat, expanded flat ABC. Then we have this three. Okay. Uh, and then we have this fourth wave. Okay, that should be a, a sharp correction. It's going like a sharp correction. Okay, uh, let's let's measure it now. Let's measure using the fib retracement tool. I'm going to start from my two here. All the way up to the end of my three. Okay, here we have retraced it. We have retraced 50%. Okay, my count is starting to really not convince me. Okay, it's starting to show weakness. Uh, I don't really think that we have this. Why? Because of this long one, two, three, four, five. This is gonna probably gonna go down to six one eight, six five. It's gonna break this region. This region here. Let me zoom in a bit. Huh? This region here. Here we have a clear one, two, three, four, five. We have a clear motive impulse wave down right here we have it it's clear we are now in the fifth wave well it's clear doesn't matter how uh, what is the higher degree you are naming it but it's a clear sharp correction of this whole structure here and it's going down it's it's probably test this level here okay the problem is is that hmm the problem is that we have this region of of uh, wave one. We shouldn't be going to this region according to Elliott waves rules, Elliott wave rules of, of uh, Elliott waves guidelines. We shouldn't, unless we are in a diagonal, and this is not the. This is not a diagonal, okay? Not the, the not really. I, I need to to take a look, but it's not a diagonal, okay? So, as I said. If we break, it's not wrong if I label it as a four, but if we go down here and we we, we stay, here, we finish this fifth wave here, going down to the uh, seven six seven six hundred and perhaps lower, seven five hundred, it's possible because it's just the beginning of the fifth wave. Okay, guys. So imagine that we have a um, imagine this correction here. One two. Three, four, five. We might go to seven, eight, six here. Okay. I'm sorry. 
something like this where it's possible to be to to hit 7500 okay it's possible um so then it's really it's it's not it's we, we broke the rule it's simple i can't keep this count okay then it's invalid as i said it's invalid but what's the matter of it okay it's no problem i have an alternate count yes as i said yesterday or and i as i have been saying this truncated fifth was an, um, an attempt for me to solve this problem here of this fourth wave that I consider this movement here a corrective movement. If I am wrong, okay, I'm, I have another count. I have another way of, view, of viewing it. I, I, have, I, I don't have problems saying, okay, this count was not precise enough, but this is okay. This is perfect, actually. I'm learning. And not only that, this is gonna be wrong in a way that I can profit because if it, this is going down and I said this was going down and I have I just need to lever my my buys if I'm going to if I'm going higher here I just need to buy to lever my buys lower here just need to pay attention to the market and acting accordingly that's it I, and this was uh, I said this yesterday if it goes to this region here i have this market like here i am gonna assume that then we have finished the first wave then we are have our second which is actually likely so what i'm saying that we have a second way I, I am talking about my other account my my alternate count here okay if we go to this region here we need to to imagine that what we have is something like this okay this is this is one of um, this is one count. This is um, alternate count, okay. That this was uh, okay. This we need to disregard this because this is considering my other count. Final wave, final third wave. Let me remove this. Um, so we have finished the fifth wave here, okay, and we have finished the ABC here of a higher degree, okay. What this is my higher degree daily chart okay let just let, let me just show you guys yes just remember this is my a b c d e pattern we have finished the wave e wave two of a of this degree here going up and we broke out of this pattern now we are back in the pattern which is oh my goodness what's happening we have all this this is a correction guys Come on, right? This is not a problem. We are sitting above the 200 EMA. We we are not really. We are back in. We are back. Uh, we we crossed the, this trend line here, but it's really possible that we are gonna go up again. But we need to be what? We need to be reactive. We need we need to be considering different options. Okay. Okay. Let, let's go back to this. Um, to this 60 minutes here. Just to this one hour. Okay, this is my alternate count, uh, which is going to probably be my, my, this is going to be my, not going to be my alternate count anymore, but it's going to be my primary count. Let me take out this fib retracement here. Okay, so you have here the fifth wave. We have finished this whole downtrend here, this C wave. Okay, I'm not going to dig into this C here, but that's it. We have a, a new low here. Okay, this is the lowest low of the year so far okay and we have our c then we have our one this is what oh, i'm sorry one i'm i'm don't like this i don't like this one but i am accepting it this then we have this two that's really strange and it's sharp okay if we allow this um two it's sharp and according to the alternation we need to have a a flat four and we have a flat four we have this a b and c we have a flat four so it's okay it's okay right here we have our flat four okay flat okay flat because we see b going beyond the beginning of the a and c really going uh lower than the a we have this flat four it's okay it's everything fine and then we have this fifth wave. We finish this fifth wave. We have um, finished the one, two, three, four, five. We have established the first wave here of this degree here that is a um, uh, minuet. Okay, we have established this first wave, and we would now be correcting to our second wave to 
begin this to to start this wave three here of a uh, of the minuet and challenge start challenge this 10k here okay this is um let's measure it okay uh let's measure first if we are if consider this as a wave one oops not really uh this is our one um, project two okay um, damn it uh, i have two of those sorry guys okay so here you have the the projection so wave three would be like trying to hit the 160 one one hundred six one eight one hundred seventy five, but we haven't okay. And the wave B almost hit it. <laughs> this is nice, okay. But this was this is our wave three clear, okay. Considering this count, uh, extended wave three, and then we have our fifth wave. Let's measure our fifth wave, okay. Uh, what did I? Okay, now this line I want to delete this thing here. Sorry. Okay, let's use again our fib we our fib extension uh, to let's measure the fifth wave in relationship to our three. Okay, three project to four. So our yes, so everything is perfect. We don't have an extended fifth. We have a, a shorter fifth, probably the a little uh, the length of one. I need to measure, but it's uh, three is the longest as it's often is yes three is the longest so perfect everything is perfect in this scenario here everything is perfect okay uh the f let's see the two the two retraced let's see here the two retraced right to the golden pocket okay if we assume this we pierced 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 to the golden pocket here six one eight six five and we go up okay and the fourth retraced to the two extended to our three here okay we have we had a shallow wave four but it's okay it's 2360 shallow wave th wave four okay and then we are now going down okay to see what where we we could land we, we would need to use our fib retracement tool here again let me just use my fib retracement tool here starting from the bottom here Pulling it all over until we get to this high here of the fifth wave. And here we have our pocket of the 61865. Okay. Where did we get, guys? We get we get here. We, we remember we have we need an ABC. ABC here. Okay. If this is the count, if this is the count, we need an ABC. And we might get as low as six eight hundred. We might break the 7k k region okay we might and the and um if we, if we assume that we have a little bit room left to go down this is our a okay a b c or i am or am i gonna count this as an a b because this is this that's one problem okay my other count i have something different right i have this <clears throat> as an A, B, and then we have a C. Okay, this count here is a bit different. I, let me zoom in a bit. Okay, so if, if this is what is happening, can I count five waves to finish our our A wave here? Okay, because this is the problem. Okay, if we say if you say this is a one, two. Three, four, five, and then we have an A here. Is correct? I'm asking, guys. Hmm. Let's see. Let's measure, okay? This is our top to our bottom. We haven't hit the the six one eight six six one eight six five percent. We have fifty percent. Yeah, which is a good spot for a wave B. That's why I labeled here a wave B. Okay, I assume that we have finished the A here and we have a B. We, why? Because we hit 50%. Okay. Remove. And then we have this. This is a three wave. This looks like a three wave, right? 
It's just strange. But then we have this one, two, three, four, five. So, so we might say you have a one, two, one, two, and then we are going to finish this way, this first, this, this A wave here. Okay. Let me. One way of knowing this is, um, sorry, one way of knowing this is doing the opposite, doing the using the retracement tool again, but swinging from the highest to the lowest. Oh, sorry, highest point here to the lowest, and then we might we we see this six one six this point here. This might be the where we land our A, which is fun because it's where we have this cluster here, right? Where we have this cluster here is where we would have our A, if we consider this as our primary count. Okay, if you consider that this is what's happening, we're gonna low first. Well, first of all, we will need to go down to this region here again. Okay, this is our seven five hundred, seven four hundred. 7500 okay we would go down to this region here and then retrace 50 percent okay retrace b here okay let me show you the waves and then we would go we would go down and break 7k we would need to break this region here i'm sorry this region here of wave one this would be a, a huge resistance okay huge resistance might not get there might stop here at the fourth wave okay this is another resist you see some confluence here um 50 percent 50 percent this is um we tried we tried to break this is the fib from the top of this high here 10k almost 10k to the lowest here of the year we have here the 61865 we tried to break it and it, we are now retracing and we have the 50 percent we broke the 50 percent okay we broke it but we might go down again to this 50 percent to test it okay okay let me let me show you what what i'm talking about because it might be a little bit confusing let me show you again let me take this out okay this is the fib retracement i'm pulling from the top to the lowest point here okay here we have the 50%, okay? And we are now testing it, okay? This is one of, now it's a support, okay? Because we broke out of it, okay? It was, previously it was a resistance, we broke out of it. We tried to break the 61865, but we are now retracing and probably are gonna break this 50, this, this support here, okay? This cluster here, this huge cluster where we had the fourth wave, this fourth wave going down, it's now acting as support, but if this is the scenario that we have, okay, if this is the right count, we are gonna break it, and then we are gonna test it again and break it up, and then we are gonna go down again and have this wave too, okay? What's gonna tell us whether I am right, whether, okay, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm never right, but <laughs> I'm never, <laughs> I, I am, what I'm presenting is uh, possible scenarios, but what 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 is gonna tell us whether this count here is correct or this one? It's the uh, where it's the amount of retracement. If we retrace to those levels, actually, I said that it wasn't possible, but actually yes, it's possible that we retrace to seven seven hundred. That now that I'm thinking about it, by by only a week. Okay, if we have a really short fifth wave okay really short fifth wave here and then we retrace mm. then we start going up then i will be really confident that this is the count that we have this is a fourth wave and then we are going up okay because we just you're gonna have a, just a week here piercing through this region here and retracing but if we see that bitcoin is going down and really uh, going to this region here of uh, 7400, 7500, and testing this region here and then retracing. If it goes to this region here of 7500, 
I meant four, and with traces. This is my count. We have a we starting. We we, we don't we 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 would have we we will have finished a wave A, and then we will retrace to our wave B, and then we would have our wave C. Okay, going going down here. As I said, waves two are. Waves 2 can go really deep, okay, as it has been the case with Bitcoin. So this is the region, right? Again, showing to you guys. 61865, okay, it's a region. Remember, this was the region that we we were all looking at to break, right? Because this was the 61, uh, 68, uh, 6800 region. So we might test this region again, but now as a support. It was a previous resistance. We, we were uh, trying to break it. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Tried really, really hard to break it, but then we, we, we succeeded. But now we might test this region again, but acting as a support. Okay? So, that's it. I think I, I have covered a lot of ground. If you guys enjoy my videos, if you guys... Uh, like my my content please subscribe and like give me a thumbs up follow me on twitter follow me on facebook and that's my twitch cam akumaldo um guys always pay attention always open your minds to different possibilities do not accept to be right accept to be wrong this is a really good piece of device accept to be wrong because then you can easily change your your direction and um and act accordingly and then then you're gonna see profit over the long run okay beautiful um and as always enjoy your trades guys come on that's why we are doing this if you don't enjoy it mm. okay cheers bye bye